What's up guys? Welcome to the channel. My name is Saray Karen. So many of you responded well to the Spotify versus Apple Music videos and had a lot of amazing input regarding the two services. One big question I got in the comment was, how do I transfer my playlist or move my music from Apple Music to Spotify or vice versa? In today's video, I'm gonna show you just how to do that. I'd appreciate it if you guys drop a like as it helps more people find the channel and don't forget to subscribe so you never miss an upload. What's up guys, like I said in the intro, I am so excited to talk to you guys about Free Your Music, an application that is going to assist you with transferring your music from Spotify to Apple Music or transferring your music from Apple Music to Spotify or any streaming platform that you guys use. Free Your Music reached out to me because of you guys. A question that I constantly got was, hey Saray, do you know how to transfer my music from this platform to this one? I really wanna keep my playlist, I really wanna keep all of my songs. And honestly, at the time of filming those videos, I had no idea how to transfer your music. But Free Your Music reached out to me and I was so happy that they wanted to partner with me and I was so happy to be introduced to their amazing application. So I'm gonna go over how to do just that, you guys. We are gonna go over how to transfer your music. For me, I'm going back from Spotify to Apple Music. Like you guys know, I did delete my Apple Music in the last video, so I downloaded it again. I got the subscription again just for you guys to make this video and I transferred my music from Spotify to Apple Music, all of my playlists, all of my songs. I did that, I took the step so you guys wouldn't have to and I could bring this video to you so you guys can see just how easy it is. And then by the end of the video, I hope you guys go on over to Free Your Music, check out their amazing application, especially if you guys are looking to move your playlists and your songs from Spotify to Apple Music or Apple Music to Spotify. So let's get into showing you guys how to do just that. I did it on my iPhone, I just felt that it was easier but free your music is an application that supports many different software operating systems so it is supported by iOS Mac and Android but I thought downloading it on my iPhone because those are where my streaming platforms are I thought it would be pretty easy to do that so I'm going to throw up my screen share here or here and I'm gonna walk you guys through downloading the app I'm gonna walk you through the steps of getting logged into your Spotify or getting logged into your Apple Music and then just moving those songs and playlists right over. You guys, it's so easy, so streamlined. Their UI is really easy. I mean, you really can't mess this up. All you guys have to do is go over to your app store. I already have the little app icon for free your music right here on my phone, but if you don't, obviously you're watching this video, you guys are going to want to download it from the Apple App Store or the Android App Store. Download the app and as soon as you open it up, you're going to want to select what application you guys are moving your songs from. For me, that is going to be Spotify and then what application you guys are moving your music to. And for me, that is going to be Apple Music. And again, this application is so amazing. It does support many different music streaming platforms. I believe I saw Tidal on there. I saw Amazon Music along with Spotify, along with Apple Music. So if you guys don't use the ones that I'm talking about in this video, mainly being Spotify and Apple Music, don't worry. Free your music definitely has all the apps all of the music streaming platforms here for you to be able to move those playlists over so once you get into the app you guys it's super easy Ugh, you guys know how much I love a streamed UI once you get in there it's going to prompt you to sign into your music streaming platform so if you don't know your passwords make sure you guys take this time uh, uh. Pause the video, get your uh, passwords and usernames down. So that I ran into that problem yesterday and it made this process a little longer. But once you guys have your username and password from Spotify or from Apple Music, you're just going to be prompted to sign in. As you guys can see, I already have my Spotify. I believe that's Spotify on this side, yeah. I have Spotify here and then Apple Music is right over here and then all I had to do was select all of the playlists that I wanted to move from Spotify to Apple Music and select whatever songs I wanted to move and that was it you guys. I selected my songs which was all of them and then I just moved them on over to Apple Music and that was it. It was super easy if you guys can see down here 
you have your transfers uh you can start multiple transfers say for instance you wanted to go from spotify to title you can do that as well but you have all your transfers down here like i said the ui is super nice super streamlined and then you select your music and that is it you guys simple as that no hassle i really like the service it was just so fast like signing into my music library from spotify and then moving the songs over uh that whole process like setting it up took probably 10 minutes to get the initial setup. I will say I was going to leave this to the end of the video, but I do want to point out right now, you guys, if you have a large music library like me, I started this transfer at about 11:42 a.m. yesterday. I'm filming this on Sunday, so uh, I started the transfer on Saturday. It did take quite a while for the transfer to completely finish. I want to say it finished around like 5 p.m. that day, but again, just be mindful that it will have something to do with how many songs or how many playlists you guys are going to be moving over. I know some of you guys may be thinking, wow, Saray, an app to just transfer all of your music, that is it. The setup took 10 minutes and I'm like, you guys, yes it's that easy i just didn't even think a service like this was out there so again i'm so happy that free your music decided to partner with me and bring the sponsor video to you guys because it is just that easy i remember back in the day like when you were trying to move your music from one platform to the other you had to use all these third-party apps you had to go through two different applications three different applications sometimes but with free your music it's super super easy and i'm really really happy that i was able to get all of my playlists from Spotify, as you guys can see here, it was just downloading and moving all of my songs, all of my playlists. If I already had a particular song or a particular playlist in Apple Music, it just kind of matched that so I didn't get duplicated songs and then it went over to the next playlist or song. So you're not getting these duplicated songs, it's just moving over your playlist exactly how it will look in Spotify. So I wanna show you guys that too. I just, I just couldn't believe it, it was just, it, it was so nice, so streamlined, and I just, I couldn't be more happier to have my Spotify music look identical to my Apple Music library. Um, if you guys are watching this video, obviously it's really important to you as well. But yeah, so you guys can see, you guys already saw what my Spotify looks like, but I'm gonna just show you guys again. I have all of my playlists here. The first one is my like songs. Then I have your episodes. I have Porter Robinson's album, just everything. Playlists that I made by myself, everything all here on Spotify just you guys and then I'm gonna open up Apple music let's go Apple mute I really should put Apple music back on my home screen um, I did get like three free months of Apple music because I uh, got rid of the subscription before so three free months I definitely got it back uh, yeah I need to add that to my home screen but you guys take a look this is my Apple music obviously Apple music the little logo where did it go Then in Apple Music, you guys, this is everything. This is identical to what Spotify just had, everything. And I was more so impressed. I didn't know that it was going to bring over my like songs. If you use Spotify, then you know that your like songs, um, it's not really a playlist. It's more just all of the songs. You're basically just your playlist library. Um, and it moved that over too. And I was not expecting that. Like these are all of the songs from my liked songs. I'm just, I'm super excited. I can't wait to listen to these songs on Apple Music. Maybe use spatial audio. Uh, just try out everything because now I have my whole Spotify library in Apple Music. Free Your Music is the easiest way to transfer your music and they let you test the app for free. You guys will get one playlist that has up to 100 songs so you guys can try before you buy. Free Your Music also provides three service tiers which include basic, premium, and a lifetime service. The basic plan is a one-time charge of $14.99 and it allows you to transfer unlimited tracks. Free Your Music is also available on iOS, Mac, and Android. So anyone that has any type of phone or any computer will be able to transfer their music from Apple Music to Spotify or from Spotify to Apple Music or any of the other streaming services that are out there. And you guys, as you can see, 
Uh, it did take a little bit of time. You see that it's just moving, doing its thing. You see that it's going through all of your songs, moving your songs over from Spotify to Apple Music, and you can just leave your phone. If you want to use your phone, you don't have to worry about, you know, do I have to keep this application open? That was something that I really loved throughout this process was that I could go about my day as these songs were being transferred in the background, and then boom, everything, everything that I have on Spotify is now on Apple Music. And you guys, I just, I couldn't be happier. Uh, I couldn't be happier again that they reached out to me and that I had the opportunity to bring this application to you guys because I know just like me, you guys are really into your music. So there we go. Free Your Music is the app that I'm using, you guys. Again, everything that you need to know is going to be down in the description. Make sure you guys drop a comment and let me know what do you guys think? Did you even know that this type of application existed? Because I sure didn't. I was blown away when they reached out to me and I am even more blown away that my music is in two places, exactly the same, identical. I didn't have to do anything crazy. All I had to do was sign in. It wasn't a difficult process at all. And yeah, you guys, I can't talk highly enough about Free Your Music just because it's a really easy app to use, love the UI. And that's about it, you guys. That is it for this video. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. I hope you guys will definitely go check out the description. Please check out Free Your Music if you guys watched my Apple Music versus Spotify or Spotify versus Apple Music videos. I know this is a service that you guys are definitely going to get some value out of. So again, everything you need to know is down in the description. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.